Hi everyone, this is Tina. Welcome back to my channel. I have some uh, hauls that I did and I want to share the things with you. Um, and I want to also say I hope everybody has a wonderful weekend this weekend. Um, and thank you so much for coming over and joining me on my channel. And I hope you like what you see. So, um, alright. So, let's start with um, this one here. This was an order from... Doodle Bug Wah, I believe. Yes, this was Doodle Bug Wah. Here is the card. And I went over to pre order um, the new color from Tim Holtz. Um, this is the new uh, prize ribbon, it's called. And I got the ink and the refill for that. Um, and like I said, it was, it's available now, but when I ordered it, it was on pre-order. So here is the new color. I'm excited to stamp it out and see how it looks. And I started to try to collect the refills. Um, I, when I bought my set, when I was buying these, I didn't buy the refills and I should have bought refills because I have a few pads that need to be re either replaced or uh, filled up with ink. So this time when I ordered, I made sure that I ordered it with the refill. So this is the new color. If you guys didn't know, Tim Holtz came out with another color um, for his oxides. And this is it right here. Okay. So I got that. And then I had some reward points over there with them. So I decided to go ahead and use my reward points. And I was able to pick up two um, stamp sets. So the first one that I picked up was the... Uh, pretty pink page and I picked this one up and it's called um, sunflowers it's really pretty and I love sunflowers my my daughter loves sunflowers I have a sister that really loves sunflowers so um, I'm gonna be making some cards with this and sending those along just some quick hello cards but that's pretty pink page and it's called sunflower or sunflowers okay and then I got this one from Ulta new and this one is called Paint a Flower Camellia. Camellia. Paint Paint a Flower Camellia. It's really pretty. It comes with sentiments. And there is a picture on the back with what it colored up. So you can see it better. Um, but it's a beautiful stamp set. And it does come with uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven sentiments, which is really awesome. And that's from Ultra New. So that's what I got at Doodle Bug Wah. Okay. And then I um, was watching Jill Norwood. And she is um, working now with Kathy, who is the, uh, the Peachy Keen lady. She had retired and retired her stamps. And I used to be part of the club. And I used to order the, you know, it used to come automatically. And then when she uh, retired... I was looking through them and I had loads of them and I decided I didn't need that many. So I started de-stashing them and now I regret it. Um, I really regret it because all those kits were so beautiful, so nice. And um, yeah, crazy me, I went and de-stashed them all. So anyway, I wanted to get, Jill had put up a link in her video to go get the two sets that she always uses that everybody asks for. And um Kathy was really, really nice and said yes. And then Kathy got overwhelmed with orders. She couldn't believe it. So many people came over and ordered. She had to have her husband make up some more sets um, so she could fulfill all the orders that she got from Jill's um, video. Crazy. <laughs> but anyway, she did say that she's going to be um, bringing sets out and she's going to be mentioning Jill's name. And every once in a while, um, she'll have something um, that you can purchase. But you have to find her over on Facebook because she doesn't have a, if there's no shop. Okay, so if you're looking for it, you're going to have to look over on um, Facebook. If I can find the links that Jill left at her uh, shop, I mean under her video, and I'll make sure it works because I'm not sure if these are this promotion thing is done or not. But I'll check it and see if it works. If it works, I'll leave it down below. And then I'll look for the Facebook group and I'll put that down below too. Because you can contact Kathy through Messenger on Facebook. 
and you can ask her any questions you have or about any specific sets in case, you know, maybe she has uh, more that she's going to be bringing out. But anyway, this is what I picked up because of Jill, these two sets here. And this is called Fun Shine Faces. And that's what they look like. They're just so super cute. And I don't know for the life of me why I de-stashed mine. And I had this one before and I de-stashed it. This is called Spa Girls. I just love the little faces. You can put these on your gingerbreads and that is what Jill does. Or you can put them on any type of image, um, any image that you um, are coloring up and you want to just add a face. They're so cute. And then while I was over there, I noticed that Kathy had some of the big sets available. So I asked Kathy if she would combine my shipping and put these together. And then I ordered two of the sets um, that she had available. And this one is called the Every Everyday Character Faces. And with the big sets, you get different sizes. So this is the same smile. And it's uh, this is a 3 8 1 half, 5 8 3 4 and 1 inch. And this would be all that face. And then this face, all the sizes are here. This is how the big ones work. And you get all the way over here. And then these are the faces for this one. And then you get this face here. Super cute. And that's what they look like. Okay, so I got that one, and then I ended up picking this one up, and this is Sweet Innocent Faces. And same deal, this is the this is the sizes they come in, and with this one, you get two of the bigger faces. And Jill has made the cutest, um, the cutest gingerbreads with these faces. So I'm going to give that a try and I am not going to de-stash these anymore. <laughs> okay. So that was that. Um, I lost my pin for my glue, my, um, um, art glitter glue. I lost the pin, but I've been using, um, this stand that Ginger Ponda had gifted me. Um, I don't know if this is where it's from. Stan, Standy's Standy. This stand is awesome, you guys. It's so awesome. It's just, you fold it up and you put it on your desk like that and you put your glue bottle in there like this and lean it. You do not have to put a pin in this or anything. This glue will not dry up and it will sit there like that. Do you know how uh, frustrating it is when you use the art glitter glue and you have to stop to put the pin in it because if you don't and you continue doing what you're doing, um, by the time you go back, it, it's either dried up on top or clogged again. So with this stand, um, you can just put it in like that and leave it. And it's so easy. You grab it, you use it, and you set it back in there. And I guess what with this felt stuff down here and the glue tip up against it, like on the bottom, it keeps the glue going down and it keeps it ready to go for you all the time. So um, if you could find these or if you get know where to get these, um, this is a, a must in your craft room. But anyway, I lost the pin and I wanted to make um, some of the pin stoppers with the beads, but you need stainless steel for that. So I went over, I found these on Etsy and this store is called Escape Journals. Um, see this is what it's called and again if I can find the link I'll leave it down below and she had uh, a set of five um, yeah a set of five for two dollars and sixty cents of the the um the pins the one and a half inch I wanted the one and a half inch these are going to be for the the charms you know to put charms dangle charms on them but that's why I got them so long. One and a half inch is what I got. But they were two sixty. I ended up getting two packs. Um, but this is this. They're stainless steel, and they're about that long. But I think they're perfect for. Um, and they will fit in the glue. Let me see. They will fit in the top of the art glitter glue nibs. See, it goes right in there. So you won't have a problem with. Um, you know, sometimes you find the stainless steels and then you, 
I, I bought some and they don't fit. They're too thick and they won't go in the bottle. So these do fit in the glue bottle and you get five and they are stainless steel. They will not rust. And you get five in the thing for 260. And like I said, I picked up two. Um, I will try to leave the link as well for this shop down below. So you can see that you can go over and check them out. And then I did some Facebook market um, buying some stamps. And uh, this lady was really, really nice. Um, she wrote me a little note and she says, once again, oh, she, this is the first one. That's why she said once again. Um, this was the first set that I picked. And um, she said, dear Tina, thank you for the purchase. I appreciate, um, I have included a free stamp. Enjoy, Diane. Um, so she was off Facebook Marketplace. And this is the stamp that I picked up and it is called, I think she had it marked here. I think it's called, um, oh my gosh. I'll have to look on the on Facebook Marketplace because she didn't label it, but um, it's so cute. It's like a garden themed and I really loved it. So here you have a garden bench with a little hat. This is from 2000, no, this is actually from 1995, Stampin' Up. Um, so you get the little garden bench and look at this, you guys, it's barely used. And then you get the little birdhouse on the post. You get a little fence and then you get this little sentiment and the sentiment says simple pleasures are life's greatest treasures and all the stamps are barely used if any if it, if they use them it doesn't even look like it so I got that set see that um, and then this is the stamp she gave me free with this order um, it's not it's not too bad. It's a really cute flower. I like it And for free why not? I think it's a lily. It's a I don't know what who makes this rubber stampede and I'm not sure it has let's see Yep, it's an iris Classic iris is what it's called and the number is two dash or Z. I'm sorry the letter Z dash one seven eight dash nine if you're looking for it so that's an iris and that was free with this order and then i got one more set from her i got it after she already boxed this up and sent well this was on its way so she had to do a separate package but she gave me a deal she didn't charge me the full shipping price which was really nice of her um, cause this, I, I said it too late. She had already boxed it up. This one here, it says, once again, thanks for your purchase. I have included a free stamp to show you my appreciation. Enjoy Diane. That was so, so sweet. So nice of her to write, you know, a personal uh, note. And so this stamp is called old friends and you have the Raggedy Ann and Andy sitting on a swing. So cute. And it is a 2000. And again, look at that. It's like brand new. It might have been stamped once. And then you get this little heart. It says for you. That comes in the set. And then these little tiny flowers. So you can build a scene around them on the swing. And then this here. It says nothing is as comfortable as an old friend. And there it is so cute i love it see it's gently used there's some ink on that but look at how clean she kept them really really nice um i like that and then um she gave me a free stamp with this one and this is a coffee stamp and oh my gosh it is so nice i love it so this is the stamp she gave um sweet comforts it says isn't that nice and let's see this is a 1999 and it's creative Calligraphy Ink is what the company is. Oh, Hampton Art Stamps. Sweet Comforts. And over here it says 1999. It says um, the, Lin the Lynn Norton Parker Collection. Creative Calligraphy Ink. So really, really cute. I love it. And she gave me this one free. And it's all but new gently used so that was really nice so though that is what i have for my hauls 
this week hopefully um i just have i did order two more stamps on marketplace you guys it's so addicting i cannot i can't get enough i sit and watch tv at night and i just scroll through and something catches my eye i either buy it some some of them have the button to buy right now you can buy it right away or um, some of them, you have to contact the seller, send a message, and then they'll send a message back and give you tracking and all that other stuff if you purchase from them. Or if you have any questions, usually they come right back and um, answer your questions. But very, very addicting. I'm telling you, if you start buying on Marketplace, you won't stop. <laughs> all right, you guys. I hope everybody has a, a blessed weekend. Enjoy your families and your weekend time and hopefully you get some crafty time in there as well um i will be back with one more video today i got happy mail so i'll be back shortly thanks for watching bye everybody